what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so we still don't have anything concrete officially to talk about regarding jeepers creepers 4 yet i just wanted to make a quick video sharing my thoughts on what character i feel like should return judging from the direction that we seem to be going in with this film and just kind of give my two cents on that on what character i feel like would be the best to bring back given the fact that it doesn't seem we're going to be getting the appropriate story that i know we want with trisha jenner we're instead focusing on two new characters sydney not sydney craven that's not her name that's that's the actress's name we have chase and lane the boyfriend girlfriend couple who will be traveling to louisiana for the horror hound festival and there we're presuming the creeper will awaken and their friend sam will be with them and they will get preyed upon by the creeper lane will presumably get taken chase and sam will go on the hunt for her to save her from the creeper and some other characters will factor into this group that goes out to hunt the creeper that's what we seem to be getting with this new film that's what the direction she's be doing so what i would like to see since it also seems that they will be going into origins a bit given that the behind the scenes images we've seen have shown like effigies or just like little shrines to things i meant to say uh, we've seen symbols related to certain voodoo voodoo religious voodoo re religious practices i'll just say and yeah that's pretty much all i had to say there about the direction that it seems to be going in nothing really indicating that trisha will get involved it doesn't seem it's going to have anything to necessarily say on how the third film ended since it did in at 20 in 2023 just like how the second film ended in 2023 the third film also ends there so i, I kind of do like that dynamic though uh just to go off 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 topic real quick how the third film ends in 2023 with trisha and then the second film ends in 2023 with the taggarts the two people or two families that we were expecting to come together for the final chapter against the creeper and yet we're not getting them <laughs> because jeepers creepers 4 is supposed to be again starting a new trilogy but with that being said gina phillips i'm not expecting her to be in this i would love to see her back don't think she'll be in it just as i don't expect jonathan breck will be in it but the character that i would like to see come back since it looks like we'll finally get some concrete origins discovered is giselle i would like to see giselle come back not necessarily portrayed by patricia belcher once again who i think is a great actress i've seen a lot of her other previous works i haven't seen her in anything too prominent since good luck charlie i think she's done some minor roles in some television shows i might have overlooked over the years i've seen her in some commercials but i haven't seen her really too prominent since good luck charlie when she played the next door neighbor but i would like to see her character come back would love to see her back in the role but the character of giselle i just feel like would be an appropriate character to have back given that we know that the character of lane will be going through this whole vision stuff and you know who better to talk to her about visions if we bridge into a sequence such as that where we get giselle back in the back in the fold of things somehow as the film progresses then giselle so like giselle herself is an actual psychic it's yet to be seen again how lane will even come across these psychic visions same thing with minxie maybe giselle can provide some insight into that just through some more random visions that she's had because again like i've said before the original film i've said this in the past on some videos the original film it establishes giselle as a psychic which eliminates me having the question why is she getting visions of the creeper it establishes her as a psychic she has visions about several different things some people have even said that they don't like that aspect and i kind of understand it because it seems like a, a lazy cop-out way to just kind of provide slight origins for this thing that we just have a, a psychic character in your film all of a sudden uh but you know compared to what we've gotten with minxie who wasn't established as a psychic scotty said it best and I, it's like the film was poking fun at itself too she was waving pom-poms earlier in the day now all of a sudden she's psychic but she was never psychic earlier or maybe the creeper when his present when he's near it unlocks the psychic abilities that many of us possess <laughs> who knows i hope they try to rationalize it in some way in the second film or in the fourth film that's coming out but like i said before giselle was the only person out of these people that are having these visions that was rationalized as to why they're having them she was already a psychic she's having visions whether the creepers here or not these other people are just having visions about the creeper why is that we don't have to worry about that with giselle because giselle was just established as being a pure psychic so 
I would like to see that character come back. She was supposed to be in the second film. She was supposed to be in the third film. Many of you who read the, the script for Cathedral, you know that she didn't really do much in that film. She kind of was just there laying on the couch for most of the film. She did kind of uh, at the end, once everything was said and done, she shared some words saying, saying that it's over. And then the, the script kind of leads into Derry, Derry Jr. having his final words before we cut to black. And then that's the end of the creeper. That was supposed to be the end of the series. This franchise should have, was supposed to be over as far as I can remember back in 2009. So <laughs> the fact that we're here so many years later and it's it's like it's struggling. It's we all know why it's struggling. It, it's just a real shame when you have someone who's clearly talented with making horror movies. But then, you know, they're doing the, the stuff that they're doing that they have no business doing because the two can coexist they can coexist you can have someone who's very talented but at the same time their talent is not going to outshine this these things that you do which he he should have gotten longer time we all know that anyone who knows what his man did we know that he deserved longer time that was not right at all so we know why this franchise is suffering it's unfortunate that such a unique character was brought to life by this man but you know it's a shame that someone that clearly has a vision for horror also has such a tragic history. And now this franchise has been suffering ever since. So Giselle in general, I think she would be a unique character or an important character to bring back. Maybe to get some insight, hopefully on these visions. Maybe she has visions about the visions. <laughs> I don't I don't really know. I, I just hope that something happens with a returning character. I'm not expecting Ray Wise to be back. I'm not expecting luke edwards to be back not expecting jonathan breck not expecting um maria delfino i think she played Rhonda in the second film not expecting anyone i'm not expecting double d's actor to be back he he's not even that that big of an actor to begin with i haven't seen him in any anything serious since jeepers creepers 2 um i would love to see giselle back hopefully get some more visions and get some cool scenes with her kind of hear what she's been going through over the last 23 years maybe she'll talk about trisha <laughs> but let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below who would you like to see back other than trisha <laughs> let me know down in the comment section below if you had already make sure you, make sure you subscribe turn on post notification in this video in the description i have links on my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there let me know any movies and reviews i'm going to cover in the future without in my guys i will see you in the next video